They sent the distress code CQD, then later the new international code SOS. SOS, SOS, CQD, CQD, we are sinking fast. Passengers being put into boats, Titanic. Finally ordered to abandon their post by Captain Smith, they left, but their wireless cry for help brought the Carpathia and other ships racing to the aid of the survivors. That night at the Sconset wireless station on Nantucket, radio operator Matt Tierney had the late shift, crackling through the airways from the sinking ship now some 381 miles off Newfoundland, came word of the disaster that had befallen the Titanic. It was repeated over and over. We have struck an iceberg and are sinking. During that watch, he picked up and heard the stress signals coming in from the Titanic at Sconset Station. What he heard was the Moss code message, was the CQD, the stress calls from the Titanic, which he copied down the information that was coming across and forwarded on to New York. Tierney relayed the messages, including a news dispatch to the Associated Press to Marconi headquarters in New York. The next morning, newspaper readers learned the stunning news. The mighty Titanic had collided with an iceberg. By evening, people's worst fears were confirmed. Hundreds had drowned. The luxurious ship was lost 12,000 feet below the surface of the Atlantic. Matt Tierney, now listening to the rescue vessel Carpathia, hastily jotted his personal code MC as he relayed the names of the survivors and their messages to loved ones. Like this, from film actress Dorothy Gibson to her future husband. To Jules Brutalum, safe, picked up by Carpathia. Don't worry, Dorothy. And a similar one from another survivor. To Mrs. Anderson, safe aboard Carpathia. Do not worry, Harry Anderson. 